Hi you guys, welcome back. This week I just wanted to do a recreation of a weekly spread that I saw on Instagram and I will link that Instagram post below. Um, so I'm just starting out with my graphic paint liners. I'm using a dark gray and I'm just outlining all of the boxes for the days. And next I'm going in and I'm creating a little black box to write the days of the week in. They're not perfect in any way, but they ended up looking really nice. And I'm just and I'm gonna end up writing inside the box in a white paint liner. It's not necessarily the best white paint pen for writing over existing ink but it still shows up really quite well. Just writing in the dates um, on the top left of the boxes in a black paint pen, and I'm gonna create a little gray line through um, towards the top of the box to separate my daily um, list from my daily reflections. And because the white didn't show up very pigmented, I am tracing over it again. And I am just going to write in a little water intake chart um, for the last box. In the Instagram picture, it's a section for notes, but I do um, little daily reflections anyway. So I figured I would just condense all of my water intake into one little graph chart for the week. Um, and now I'm taking these Pit Artist brush pens and drawing little leaves up at the top and I'm going to make a drop shadow with the two greens that I had used. Since my theme this month is cacti, I wanted to stick with the green. And again, I'm not doing anything, I'm not being super, super um, precise with it, but I, I just wanted to add a pop of color and adding like a semi drop shadow or a line with the black again. And I'm just going to add a few of my little cacti stickers to jazz it up a little bit. And I added in little bullets each day and I'm just gonna write in um, anything that I already know I have to do next week so that I can have the list started. I don't really know why I did the dashes on the chart, it just, came out that way. I'm not unhappy with it, but it's not exactly what I was hoping for, so that's okay. Just cleaning up all of the pencil marks. And there's the finished spread, and then these are the pens that I used, the Faber-Castell Pit Artist pens, and I used a black and two different greens 
and then the graphic line painters in a few different colors, black, gray, and white. And then the stickers that I use. So that's all I have for you guys. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you next week. Bye guys.